coins. But uh, the question is, will the value of XRP be the same on the in the private ledgers as it is on the public? Yes. The value proposition of XRP is that it has this these liquidity pools. It, it, if it doesn't make sense to isolate something, like there's no place where gold is worth twice as much as it is now, because if there was, people would just bring gold there and they would write and they would push the, they would buy gold somewhere else and they would sell it there. Um, unless the only way that you can have the value be very different in two places is if there's a lot of friction. And if there's friction, someone will make a business of removing that friction. So I don't see any realistic scenario where XRP has significantly different value unless something's wrong. Like a good example of a case, there was a time where the value of XRP, they called it the kimchi premium, right? Where the value of XRP in some Asian countries was very high, but that was because there were capital controls, right? That was because things were bad. Um, I think that's a sign that something is not going well. The value proposition of XRP is that you can take it to all of the places, right? If I sell you some gold and you say, hey, this gold can only be used in jewelry, you're like, well, that kind of sucks. I don't want that gold, right? The value proposition of gold is that you have access to the entire value proposition of gold. And so I don't, I don't see any scenario in which pieces, where it makes sense to snip pieces off, again, unless something is wrong.